Hi there, Jake Miller here, and in this uh, video I would like to talk to you about one of the other underused tools in Google Docs, which is the different types of text styles that are pre-formatted in Google Docs. So up here you've probably seen normal text along the top of your screen, and if you click that drop down, you notice that there are six uh, total different styles here, normal text, title, subtitle, heading one, two, and three. Now most of us leave it on normal text at all times and just change the individual text as we go, but there is a uh, value in actually utilizing these tools and you can edit what they are there. So by default, all my text out here is normal text because I didn't change what it was, what is, what it was uh, going in as. So regardless of whether it's red, bold, and underlined, or this regular text out here, it's still in here as normal text. Now, let's say I need a title in my vocabulary up here, so I'm gonna make it title text. So by clicking on it, it automatically makes it this big size 26 font. Maybe I wanna center it, and I'm gonna put in math vocabulary. Okay, and now it automatically takes on that special title formatting. Now, these guys down here are still normal text, and I could change them retroactively and make them heading one and heading two. Or I'm sorry, heading one, so those are two different headings. Now, why is that valuable? Well, if I go to Tools, there's the option Document Outline, and the Document Outline will, will take anything that is a heading or a title and put it here so it's a clickable way to jump through the text, through the document to get to certain places. In this example document I have here, it's not incredibly valuable, but you can imagine if it was a really long document, it would enable me to jump quickly to different locations in the document. And I can close it out when I want to, and again, access it by going to Tools, as it says out at the bottom there, Document Outline. Okay, now, I don't like the formatting of this chapter four, chapter five here, that's my heading one. So you could change your text so that every time you open a document, you have certain types of headings and titles that are your style. So for example, if I want my headings, heading ones to be bold and underlined, okay, then I can go up to here to the drop down, click this arrow to the right here, and change it update heading one to match. Okay, and now all of the ones that are heading one now match that. Now that's not gonna stay the next time I come into Google Doc. What's gonna make it stay is if I then go down to the bottom down here, go to options and click save as my default files. Now if I open another document and go to those different styles and go down to heading one, I'm going to find that my new heading one is that exact style that I just had there. And you see there it is, bold and underlined, just like I made it before. So now I can also change my title and things like that. If I'd like my title to always be centered, I could change that. One way, I, I immediately use this when, when you know using a new Google account for the very first time to make my text larger because it defaults to Arial size 11. So I defaulted to Arial size 14. And you could also change whether what the default spacing is. So now your texts will be the way you like them to be. And now you can start using these tools as you go through your document.